My name is Mauricio Hernandez and I work with the American Embassy in Kampala. Well, the U.S. mission in Uganda, one of the main goals is to empower the youth in Uganda uh, and also women. It's very important for, for our mission. And so as part of that, we have a project called the American Spaces and we bring uh, all kinds of resources to different people at no cost so that it's available to everybody. And we wanted to make sure, we have an American center in Kampala, but we wanted to make sure we could move to the villages so that people in all over Uganda could have access to this knowledge and to these resources. And we have done that thanks to the Nile Explorer. The Nile Explorer has moved moves every year, does 20, 30, 40 stops during the year in different schools around Uganda. All of these are underserved schools where most of the students would not have access to computers, to uh, a lot of this knowledge that is given by our facilitators. So the Open Space Center has been an amazing partner in providing this experience to all the schools from selecting the underserved schools where we go, from organizing all the logistics, and from imparting all this very important knowledge in STEM, you know, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, which is very needed. Civic engagement, very important now that we're going into elections time, and HIV and AIDS prevention. We know how, it impor how important it is to keep our youth safe. So it is very important and totally aligned with all the goals of the U.S. mission in Uganda. <laughs> well, I got the opportunity of visiting the Nile High School in Arua. This has been a really a highlight of my time here in Uganda. I've already been here for three years and I had been exposed to different stops, but I had never been in person. And to be in person at one of these schools is amazing to interact with the students and understand what their needs are, to see how important it, it is, all the knowledge that we are exposing them to. Uh, for example, just having used laptops or having access to internet. Today, I was talking about artificial intelligence and it seemed like they had not heard about that. So we are really exposing them to opening their minds to new opportunities, to things that are changing in the world. And so looking at them, look, looking at how interested they are, uh, it, it, it is fascinating. It, it really makes my heart warm. It makes me happy to see that, uh, that it's having an impact for sure. This has been an amazing experience. I, as I mentioned, I've been here for over almost three years in Uganda and I had never been to Arua. So I'm very happy that I came to Arua, got to know a new place, got to know, know this amazing high school and work with the Open Space Center people, with the whole team and experience what impact we're having here in Uganda. Uh, it, it is amazing. We really want to continue with this project.